So why doesn't this work in real life? And why does it work in Kerbal Space Program? Let's take a closer look at the physics of the situation. It all comes down to the fact that the magnet is attached to the main body of the car itself. While it's true that there would definitely be a force that pulls the magnets together, there is an equal but opposite force distributed along the bar that holds it in place. In reality, this means that the bar would compress or warp if the magnetic force was strong enough. So why does it work in Kerbal Space Program, and how can you build one yourself? Here, the laws of physics operate slightly differently. Using docking ports as magnets, we can right-click them and change the magnetic force the part experiences when in proximity to another docking port. By setting the force to zero on the front docking port and setting the back docking port's force to its maximum, there is a net force that pushes the whole car forward.